Uh, we had three vehicles that were driving. We had an uh, initial crash between a Chevy Traverse and a box truck. And then following that, we had a, uh, a van that was transporting some inmates that crashed into the back of that uh, box truck. The first initial crash happened, and then there was another chain reaction crash where this van uh, crashed into the back of the box truck. The driver of the passenger vehicle was uninjured. The driver of the, of the box truck was uninjured. And then driving the van were uh, two guards uh, from a private company that were transporting federal inmates. And both of those guards were uninjured. And then four of the inmates that were in the van did receive some minor injuries, and they were transported by ground ambulance to a local hospital for treatment of those minor injuries. Actually, this, this morning for the morning commute, we had actually quite a few different crashes around our metro. So um, I don't know what led to all those crashes, but um, we had a high volume of traffic this morning for our morning commute. And uh, our investigators will be looking into what the initial cr cause of the first collision, um, why that happened. But ultimately, the, the second crash was uh, due to the first crash that happened. And that driver uh, was unable to stop in time and rear-ended the, the box truck. You know, it's just... It, it brings the, the awareness that no matter what type of driver you are, no matter where you're at, you always have to be paying attention uh, while you're driving and, and looking ahead of possibly increasing that following distance. Um, but we as drivers, no matter where we're at, we have to pay attention. And, you know, that's, we look at this morning, we had four crash, four uh, multi-vehicle crashes that happened around the metro area this morning. And with every one of those crashes, um, it brings the, the awareness that we need to make sure as, as drivers we're doing what we're supposed to be doing, that's paying attention and driving and driving safely.